morning, Mr. Jeffs. So we are here to interview you about your university. Mm -hmm. So which university did you attend and why did you choose it? Uh, I chose to go to Indiana University uh, for a few different reasons. Um, I wanted to go to a school that had a big campus with uh, a lot of students uh, because I knew I wanted to be in an environment that offered everything I could possibly want to do. Uh, I also had a lot of friends that were attending, or that were going to be attending Indiana. Uh, so I thought that'd be nice to go to school with my friends. And I also wanted to go to a school that had a good business program. Uh, I, I ended up being a business major and Indiana had a very good business program. Uh, it was a perfect fit in that regard. And also, uh, sports are a big part of my life, so I wanted to go to a school that had a big uh, sports environment. Um, and Indiana, uh, people are very crazy about their sports. Uh, so I was able to go to lots of basketball games and other sporting events, which was important to me. So what was your expectations on the university right? Or is it better or worse? I would say they were right for the most. The business program was more challenging than I anticipated, uh, which I suppose is a good thing. Uh, the, the, the university was able to offer everything I wanted to do. Um, there was nothing I thought to myself, I wish the Indiana had this. Uh, so that was great. They brought in you know, great performance uh, bands and comedians and all sorts of people in business from all over the world. So it was great to be able to meet all types of people like that. Um, so the campus life was great. Uh, the sporting environment was great. So I, I enjoyed my experience there. Business major. Um, did the major influence you in what you're doing now as a career? So I changed careers uh, maybe five or so years after I graduated. So I got a degree in marketing and what I soon learned was that a degree in marketing really pushed you towards a degree in sales. Uh, so I ended up working in sales for a few different companies after college. I uh, decided later on that that really wasn't what I wanted to be doing and I debated whether I wanted to go back to school for an MBA and continue working in business. Um, I ultimately decided that was not what I wanted to do and went to graduate school for school counseling, mm -hmm. which is what brought me here today. So, because you attend this university, so how does it shape you for who you are today? And is this what you want to do? Uh, so it shaped me in the sense that uh, you get a lot of new life experiences really at any college you go to. Um, if you find a college that's a good fit for you, you're going to have a good time there. For me, it was Indiana. Um, how it shaped me? Hard to say. Uh, I feel like I grew as a person when I was there. Uh, I was able to study abroad uh, in England while I was there, so that's a new experience that opens you up to the rest of the world. Um, I made friends from all over the country uh, that I'm still in touch with today. Um, the business program I went to was very good. I felt like, um, you know, while it wasn't what I ended up doing professionally long term, uh, I feel like I learned a lot from that program in terms of, you know, uh, developing a good work ethic and uh, learning how to study and uh, important skills that you don't necessarily, uh, they don't necessarily apply to whatever job you're doing, but apply broadly to whatever you're going to do. Mm -hmm. So I hope that answers your question somewhat. Okay, and also because you said that uni Indiana University has a big sports program. So did you join any sports team or? Sadly, I was not athletic enough <laughs> to participate in any Division I sports, uh, but I did join the Student Athletic Board, which was an organization that helped uh, volunteer at pretty much all of the sporting events that were not basketball and football. Mm -hmm. uh, they did not need the help there. But uh, so I attended lots of uh, women's volleyball games, track meets, soccer matches, uh, swimming and diving, um, all sorts of different sports all over campus where I helped with promotion, uh, promoting the events, helping with uh, setting up the event and uh, doing things like timing races for swimming or uh, mm -hmm. shagging balls at the women's volleyball game. Um, so I was able to do that and I also joined the uh, undergraduate marketing club, which was a club for marketing, people that were majoring in marketing. Uh, so. Uh, those two clubs were the primarily the clubs that I did on campus. Is there anything that you regret from your university experience? Is there anything I regret? I think I regret not majoring or at least double majoring in psychology. Uh, it was always something I was interested in. Um, now that I'm a counselor, it would some, it's something that would fit more with more aligned with my career now. So while I did take, I think 
one or two psychology classes when I was at Indiana. I think if I had to do again, I would have taken more classes in that area because it was something I enjoyed. And, uh, you know, the business program was a struggle for me for <laughs> part of the time there. Okay. So what's your best memory during your university year? I had a lot of great memories in Indiana. Uh, most of the memories you have in school when you go to college are going to involve your friends. Um, you know, obviously you're going there for the academics to get a degree and learn whatever craft you want to learn for whatever you're going to be doing. But ultimately, you'll end up remembering most the experiences you had with your friends, the places you went with them, the activities you did. So for me, it's, it was all about the relationships I developed there. Some of my best friends today our friends that I met at Indiana. Uh, I still talk to them on a regular basis, even here in Thailand. Thank you so much for being here with us today. You're welcome. Go Hoosiers.